Several national and international studies, reports and research indicate an alarmingly high rate of maternal mortality in Pakistan. The World Bank survey has placed Pakistan as one of the top 10 countries in the world with the highest number of deaths due to maternity. The maternal mortality ratio in Pakistan is 186 deaths per 100,000 live births, and the current infant mortality rate for Pakistan in the year 2023 is 55.777 deaths per 1,000 live births. Baluchistan is the most underprivileged province of Pakistan where the sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child and adolescent health and nutrition situation is more alarming and worse. Youth Association for Development with the support of Global Financing Facility Engagement Support Grants, managed by Population Action International, is implementing a project mainstreaming sexual reproductive, mother, newborn child and adolescent health and nutrition in policy, planning, financing and actions in Balochistan. The project aims to establish a hub for increasing engagement between civil society, government officials, the public, and other stakeholders when formulating and implementing sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child, and adolescent health and nutrition policies in Balochistan. Through the hub, the Youth Association for Development raises awareness about the global financing facility process and establishes community-led advocacy and accountability mechanisms in partnership with the provincial government to improve domestic resource mobilization for sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child, and adolescent health and nutrition. Established a diverse and inclusive open-ended, civil society organization and multi-stakeholders 30 members sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child and adolescent health and nutrition partnership and hub to strategically, systematically and institutionally address and respond to the sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child and adolescent health and nutrition in Balochistan. The partnership identified, documented and highlighted the sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child and adolescent health and nutrition partnership issues, challenges and barriers, and the policy, monitoring, accountability, resources, financing, and budget-level gaps, needs, and demand. For effective policy formulation, established accountability mechanism, increasing financing, allocation of budget, result-oriented government, and stakeholders' actions. Conducted one five-day strategic, systematic visioning and concept development capacity building training of partnership members. They partnership members trained on global financing facility concept process and framework CIRMCON situation evidence-based, CIRMCON's political mapping, effective advocacy, strategic communication, leadership, networking, movement and coalition building, campaigning, lobbying, accountability, monitoring, resources, financing, allocation of funding, planning, policy reforms, and getting political will and commitments. Within the workshop, the evidenced and situation-based formulating SRMCON Charter of Demand Draft, SRMCON Policy Recommendations Draft, SRMCON Advocacy Narrative Draft and SRMCON Plan of Action Drafts were produced. Conducted two six-monthly progress reviews, planning, learning and risk mitigation meetings, evaluated communication and advocacy, networking and lobbying, collected the learning and best practices, and evaluated the project's monitoring and project risk analysis and mitigation. Conducted four sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child and adolescent health and nutrition policy consultations and advocacy forums with outreach relevant diverse and inclusive citizens and relevant stakeholders. Partnership members reached the grassroots, engaged the relevant diverse and inclusive stakeholders for the SRMCON movement and coalition building, and collected SRMCON's issues, challenges, gaps, needs, and demands, and incorporated their opinions, suggestions, consultations and recommendations in SRMCON's policy and actions. The GFF concept, process and GFF investment frameworks and SRMCON charter of demand draft, SRMCON policy recommendations draft, and SRMCON advocacy narrative draft produced and shared with them, 
further collected their needs, demands, reflections, suggestions, opinions, and recommendations to finalize the drafts and share with the government and relevant stakeholders. Finalized and approved the drafts of evidenced and situation-based sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child and adolescent health and nutrition charter of demand of Baluchistan province and policy recommendation on sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child and adolescent health and nutrition in Baluchistan, and sexual, reproductive, maternal, newborn, child and adolescent health and nutrition advocacy narrative. Conducted two joint partnerships, networking, accountability, and transparency dialogues and consultations meetings. Reduced gaps between citizens and government and interacted with citizens, community, and government departments and elected representatives on GFF concept, process and GFF investment frameworks and CIRMCON's agenda and CIRMCON's produced documents. Invited government and stakeholders' attention, gained the political will and commitments to focus the investment in CIRMCON, follow the GFF concept, process and GFF investment frameworks in the government agenda, utilizing resources, increasing financing, and allocating budget for CIRMCON, strengthening CIRMCON monitoring, transparency, accountability and follow-up. Conducted two SIRMCON legislative oversight and policy reforms networking, coordination, accountability and consultations joint meetings. Increasing the knowledge and awareness of relevant stakeholders and citizens on SIRMCON key policy issues and fostering an enabling environment for mainstreaming the SIRMCON at the policy and planning level, in the light of the SIRMCON policy and planning level gaps, needs and demands guided by the GFF concept, process and framework, making the government responsible and accountable for effective policy, planning and concrete actions on SIRMCON in Baluchistan. Conducted one re-energizing, learning, and way-forward event, the overall project progress, successes, outputs, outcomes, results and impact evaluated, the project learning, best practices and weaknesses discussed, and post-project progress follow-up, advocacy, accountability, monitoring, coordination, communication, sustainability and follow-up and way-forward plan chalk out. <laughs>